it's never better time than now with, with what's going on in today's world to try Amazon Fresh. And that's what we're going to do. And I'm going to do it live right now and show you guys how it's packaged, what I got. So check it out. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, folks. So here we go. We're alive. Well, we're not live. We're live. First item up. How you say, how you pronounce that? Pakui? 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 I don't know. Hunted ghost pepper. Real pepper. Real heat. Chips. You know, so go ahead and pick. I went ahead and picked these bad boys up, and this is a certified, you know, boom. So, bam, man, this, that shit, this 50 mil lens look good on this damn camera. Goodness gracious, anyways. So, boom, pop that over there. Don't forget to do that. Bam, boom. So, we got the honey barbecue, barbecue sauce, gotta have that. Sweet, sweet baby rays. The sauce is the boss. You can, you can cook your meat real good, but that sauce, boy. So I'm going to put that up there. Uh, normally in the morning, I don't really have a big appetite. I'm one of those dudes that don't really eat breakfast like at all. Only like on my days off. Even then, I eat like around like 12 noon. You know what I'm saying? Real late. But you know, at least in the morning to get me something inside my stomach. Boom. Raising bagels. Thomas. Then, got me two apple pies. I gotta hurry up too, cause I got some ice cream inside there. But two apple pies, bam, those were a dollar each, bam. Shout out to my son, he should be coming back pretty soon from Kansas at the end of this month, which is uh, August. Yesterday was my birthday, August 5th. Like some people told me, I should have told people ahead of time, you know what I'm saying? I'm not one that really be going around telling people, oh, it's my birthday coming up, you know what I'm saying? But people said I should have, because they would have got, got me something, or just in case people wanted to give me something. Damn, you just got my damn muffins all upside down? That will, that will do me like that? All right. Damn. Anyways, got the uh, fresh banana nut muffins. And a lot of this stuff was already all five stars, you know, all these different foods. I was looking for some, uh, I've been craving a lot of, um, some, what's that, coffee cake lately. I brought some uh, recently, but, yeah. Got the muffins on deck. Corn chips, Frito-Lay. All day, every day. It's like, nah, I hardly ever eat corn chips. But I kind of, you know, want to eat something I haven't ate in a while. Boom, like that right there. I haven't had this fruit cocktail but very cherry so it's supposed to be like extra cherry sauce and stuff like that chili with no beans they're getting everything right so far you know so far so good you know chili with beans yeah i was gonna go ahead and um order my 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 different nuts and well, that didn't sound right well order different nuts and stuff that i want and my own different variety of different you know because i like different trail mix but there's certain ways i want to make it and i'm getting tired of fucking almonds inside trail mix i cannot be the only one that's getting tired of almonds inside everything like like even freaking rocky road ice cream I'm, I'm tired of almonds i don't i don't like almonds you know what i'm saying like it always be inside my way you know like it's just too hard and you just takes away it just takes away the whole experience to me like i don't know who like almonds like i'm about to go to the store and buy me some almonds i like eating almonds all by themselves like no get that shit about here my trail mix is gonna have honey roasted pistachios honey roasted nuts uh cashews and, and uh walnuts uh marshmallows like little small marshmallows um white chocolate chips regular chocolate chips and I kind of think I want to put the banana chips inside there because I do like how those would taste. Yeah, look at my son right there, by the way. And his little award certificates and stuff right there. These are all mine, so I got some more of mine and his I gotta hang up. Anyways, back to the video. Next bag. Okay, got all my vegetables and my veggies. Got my onion. My potato. Another potato. You can pick me out some better potatoes, damn it. This one like a damn dude with a pointed chin. <laughs> I ordered two of these. 
because I was thinking that they was only was gonna give me like one clove the way they were showing it in type of picture, and it was only like twenty cent or something like that. So I'm like, it must be only one like little bitty clove thing. So I mean, let me get, let me get two just in case, you know. But boom, and this was all sixty bucks, you know, a little bit above sixty bucks, about sixty three dollars. Got my eggs. I took out the bag, but here's the eggs. Cage free. Sour cream. Because my son be demolishing. I be constantly gotta buy sour cream from the uh, Cream cheese. For the bagels. Bacon. You know, down. And like Jimmy Dean sausage. I haven't brought ground sausage in a long time or ground beef in a little while. I'm trying to stay away from that type of meat, you know. But turkey and fish, mostly what I've been eating lately. Have I been the only one that's been like not even having the appetite for like food? Because like food is trying to taste fake, like faker than it ever have ever. Like, is it just me? Like, or is it anybody else out there? Like, you bite into something, you be like, you can, you know that it, like this shit is like fake. Like, <laughs> anyways, next bag. Now you see, you don't see, you don't see no frozen dinners or nothing like that. Your boy know how to cook, and when I do get frozen dinners, that's just for when I, you know, don't want to cook. Here's our frozen stuff. I like how they separate everything, because to be honest with you, uh, believe it or not, a lot of people be loving the way. I should grocery shop because when I put stuff on the conveyor belt and everything, I, I separate it by zones. I put all my vegetable stuff, on my can and, and like bottled stuff, on my box stuff like this, but it's dry, along with the bag type stuff like chips and stuff. And then I put the refrigerated stuff like this, and then I put the uh, meat, all the meat together, and then all the frozen stuff together, and then all like the little bread stuff like this and this together. People be looking at me like, damn, this dude's a damn pro, like what the hell? It's just, I don't know, I'm just a different type of dude. Super organized, that's why. I think that's take a big part. Anyways, Toaster Strudels. I was trying to find a Cinnamon Toast Crunch Toaster Strudels. My son gonna be mad at him here when you're watching this video right now, cause bam, boy! What you know about that? Cinnamon roll. Never seen this. You know? Fine, let your... Cinnamon... Uh, hold on. <laughs> Pillsbury Toaster. Hold on. I gotta do my commercial real fast. Here's my audition. Here's my audition right here for a commercial. You know, I'm holding the product right here in my hand. Got my angle. I'm gonna do my angle. Boom, got the angle right there. Pillsbury Toaster Strudels. Cinnamon Roll Edition. Grab your box. <laughs> I'm too busy smiling trying to say it at the same time. But grab your box now. While supplies last. But anyways, yeah, so just in case somebody is watching that can make some moves out there, I can do it way better than that. I'm just laughing right now. But anyway, so bam. Toaster Strudels, Cinnamon Roll, got the Heath, you know, uh, Kodak. All right, Kodak, really? That is really say Kodak? <laughs> Klondike bars or patties or wherever they are supposed to be. Boom. This is like one of the only ones they had in mint chocolate. It was all they was all out of the um, cookies and cream. It was a, it was out of a lot of stuff. I mean, that's a, it was it's a given. And then last but not least, boom, the good old Jimmy Dean biscuits. The box is kind of box is kind of super mushy. Um, man, I'm so loving how this 50 mil lens looks on this damn camera. I think the screen is making it look super good. That screen, that screen looks so damn clear, it's ridiculous. But yeah, man, um, that's it. I'm going to pop this in the freezer. Got this off 60 bucks, you know, just, it's just me here. So just a little bit something for me to be munching on before I go to work and when I come home from work, stuff like that, make my little salads. I already got stuff like the cabinets to put with this stuff to make more stuff. So, you know, bam. So if you're trying to, if you're planning on trying out Amazon Prime Fresh, I say give it a try. I've been having, I've been an Amazon Prime member for a long time. And Amazon, y'all asses owe me some money for this little mini commercial that y'all not paying me for. But yeah, man, if you plan on shopping on Amazon.com and you run across Amazon Prime and you're wondering, hmm, should I sign up? Is it worth the deal? Yes, it is. Because you get Amazon. Not only do you get 
free two-day shipping and sometimes on occasion free one-day shipping and release date shipping when it comes to video games and some movies you also get Amazon Music and you also get Amazon audiobooks along with Amazon movies so even though the library of movies isn't as big as Netflix but you get all that inside one big package well not even a big package a small package of nine nine <laughs> I hate to be inside a damn commercial I swear but now nah, people to get back serious um, yeah this is a real good you know experience I didn't even know what to say after that but nah it's a real good experience you know it wasn't nothing bad it's kind of pretty much similar as ordering a regular product off of Amazon if you're familiar with ordering things off of Amazon or ordering things offline it's not that hard you just you know place things inside the cart Amazon fresh is a whole different it's like a sub side of Amazon so when you go to the fresh side everything that you look for is fresh and stuff you have to worry about just deciphering if it's the fresh food or if it's the regular Amazon food that's going to take you know longer to get there no it, it takes you to a whole different section of Amazon but I want to try something new to see if they really actually get it right also Walmart does the same thing so um, they just don't deliver to the house but I'm pretty sure that's coming up next so yeah man with that being said subscribe to the YouTube channel the hobby collector and I'll be catching you guys in the next video for all the new subscribers old subscribers and people that have been knowing me ever since my gaming channel even channels before that thank you guys for the ride and Keep coming along for the ride, and it's been your boy, the Hobby Collector. Subscribe. I'm out. Peace.